you know there was a time a world with no electricity no fuel for transportations no machines to help with farming sounds pretty unbelievable right believe it or not it there was a time and guess what changed it all this yes a simple black rock called coal changed all of this hard to believe right yes but this little black rock played a massive role in transforming the world from steam engines to bullet trains the way things changed was mind blowing and what kick started it all this black rock called coal this changed the lives of humans for better and how did it become such an important fuel where did it even come from well let's find out so what is this coal anyway well it's this black hard substance kind of like a rock but not exactly and here is the cool part people have been using it for so many years actually for centuries even today if you look around a lot of electricity in the major cities actually in our households is generated using coal in thermal power plants the electricity that we receive at our home in major cities is generated using coal so we are directly enjoying the uses of coal and it's not just that coal is a major fuel for various industries take steel production for example it needs coal the steel that is used for building uh, houses building buildings the utensils that we use and if you think about it even at a really basic level coal is used for pressing clothes right ever been to a press shop you go and see a lot of them still use coal instead of electricity to iron clothes so our daily life is directly linked to coal but here is a big question have you ever wondered where the coal actually comes from when I mean, it's not like people just dig a hole and boom there is coal waiting for them right so what's the story behind it where did it all come from where does coal come from well the story goes way back about uh, 300 million years ago okay imagine this back then earth was covered in dense forest especially in low lying wetland areas but over time natural events like floods buried these forest under layers and layers of soil buried these forest under several layers of uh, soil as more and more layers piled up the buried uh, plants got compressed under extreme pressure and here is what's interesting deep underground the temperature also rose as well as the pressure kept increasing now this didn't happen overnight over millions of years all those dead plants remember over millions of years all those red dead plants slowly transformed into coal through a slow process called carbonization and since this coal is made from ancient vegetation it's actually classified as fossil fuel well the story of coal doesn't just end with burning itself to produce more fuel or energy for industries there is more to it coal is also processed to create some pretty useful materials like uh, coke coal tar and coal gas this whole process is called fractional distillation of coal we'll dive into the details of fractional distillation in a separate video but for now let's talk about these by products first up we have coke which is not the drink this coke is a tough black porous substance what does porous substance mean it means that it has tiny air pockets inside it and here is something interesting this coke is almost pure carbon which makes it super important for steel manufacturing and extraction so coke is the form of coal or the pro by product of the coal that is used in the steel manufacturing and also in metal extraction then there is coal tar which is like this thick black liquid with a really strong smell and it is a mix of about 200 substances it is used in making all sorts of things like uh, dyes perfumes plastic paints and even acrylic balls and finally we have got coal gas i can't show gas it is gas do not have a definite shape we know that it does not have a definite volume it takes the shape of the container and this coal gas is an invisible gas so only way i can see coal gas is it being stored in a gas tank right so yeah 
it is it is a byproduct of coal which is mainly used in industries near coal plants because it is convenient once the gas is produced it can be run through the pipeline to the nearby industries for all the manufacturing processes so coal is just coal isn't just about burning the substance it's a, it has a lot of other uses to it is processed to make coke coal tar and coal gas 